Hey guys, and welcome back to the Same Sport 100 Baby Challenge. So, all's going good in the house. We have a couple of things on the agenda today also. Now, I wanted to tell you about this display stand. Now, let me get Mandy to cook something. And obviously, it's going to be from Granny's recipe book. So, if she makes a jacko soup, so let's speed it up a little bit. So she's going to make this soup. I, I still could do with that trash lit recycling bin. And this is the display case out of Get to Work. So if you have that pack, this will be ideal for you. If you don't, guys, I, I do apologise. But this is a good method of getting your toddlers to actually eat on their own. Now, if you look at that, it's got nine hours on it. And if you put it in there, the toddlers can actually access that. And it now has three days on it. So that is going to sit there for three days. And your toddlers, if I can get someone that's hungry, can actually go into there and grab themselves a serving all of their own. See? So you don't have to watch over your babies every move when it comes to feeding them. So I thought that was quite a good tip. Uh, also, we've got a couple of age ups as well. Anna is ready to move out, guys. We're going to be saying goodbye to Anna because she is now a high school A star student. So is Luna, a student. And so is. Lizette. So Lizette and Luna will be aging up into teens and we're going to be saying goodbye to Anna. Uh, so I'm going to age her up first. Very nice Anna, very nice. Joe, you know what, let's just replace that sink. Right, so let me make a cake. I'm going to get Mandy to make the cake. Oh heck! Oh, the twinnies are fighting, guys. The twinnies are fighting. Heck. Never seen that happen in my own home before. Right, so, more choices. I want to cook a cake for Anna. Cook grub. Joe, it gets me so confused. <laughs> Sorry guys, I was just reading that. If you look up in the left hand corner, it says, Oops, Lisette needs to be more careful about what she's doing because she just knocked out a tooth. Thankfully, she'll be able to fix this in a piffy. <laughs> I think her twin knocked that tooth out, guys. I certainly do. Right, let's get on with this. Let's age Anna up. Let's make her a cake. And then we're going to give her a makeover. So, let me check my toddler's status. Harley could do with getting some food. Don't know why she's going to bed with a baseball cap on. Go and get yourself some food, pet. She needs a toilet, but she's asleep. Uh, Kurt, how long before they age up? Two days? One day? So they'll be aging up tomorrow in game. Right, so where is that cake? Bring me that cake. And then you are going to add... You know what? I wish you'd sort that out as well. Right, add birthday candles. And you're going to age your daughter up, my dear. So Anna is ready to age up. A student, here we come. And she's going to be evil. Oh, my God. So she's evil, self-absorbed, and erratic. That makes for a great combination. Right, guys. Th this is hard with the eyes closed. Right, and which one? 
Oh, she wants to be a championship rider. Right. So, a championship rider who is erratic, evil and self-absorbed. Seems good. Congratulations. Anna finished her high school experience strong and graduated with honours. Those long hours have paid off and now it's time to get paid. Starting a career in adulthood will start off with high performance, just like you did in high school. Beautiful. Right, so, she's now aged up. And I want to... We do have a mirror, don't we? So, let's plan outfits. Oh, she can flirt with herself. I think she can do that because she's self-absorbed. <laughs> We've got the twins knocking each other's teeth out. Right, my lady. Let's start off with the hair. Because I don't like it up in a bun. So let's see what we've got. I have downloaded... In fact, I think I took them out. Yeah, I took all the cosmetic stuff out, like the hairs and stuff. Because it's awkward to upkeep, guys. So how's about that for Anna? I think that quite suits her, don't you? And then let's have a look at her daily outfits. So, she is on. Give me the full body. I'm on, I'm on the full body. Why is it not showing up? Just ignore me, guys. Mm. Honestly. Right, so, day-to-day -day stuff. You know, I don't quite know what to put her in. I quite want to put her in a pair of jeans, to be honest with you. Oh, God, no. That makes her look huge. Doesn't match her head, guys. Yeah, I think I kind of want to go for the jeans approach. So let's get the bottoms. Let's get some jeans. I quite like them. And I like the trainers as well. Cover your eyes, lads. You shouldn't be looking at the bosoms. Right, so what? what is that? Oh, it's just a little tank top thing I downloaded. Let's start from the top. Do you know what I started scrolling up and actually saw a top that I quite liked? So we're just going to stick her in something pretty basic. And I kind of like to play a game with myself. If they make a umming and an ahhing sound when I click on something, I give it to them. Because it probably means they like it, guys, you see. So we're going to wait till we get the next one. No, I think that quite suits her. Ah. In the blue. Right, so she likes the blue, guys. I'm sorry, she said, ah. <laughs> I know. Mm -hmm. It's all in the name of the game. Let's have a look through the dresses. That one. Hmm. Well, I just don't think some of these are her style, to be honest. That one, maybe. Different colour. Hmm. Oh, there you go. There's a... Um. Yeah, I'm going to have her on that one. And then we're going to go for a sportswear. I'm, I'm not even bothering with the sports. That, that looks all right. So that is a nightwear, guys. What do you reckon? Yeah, I thought just as much as well. You can actually take that tea cosy off your head, dear. We do not want that for bed. We don't. I quite like that one. What is it you call it? A hijab? I quite like that. But not for bedtime. So, let's see what we're putting on up for bed. Hello. Dressing gown? That? You tell me, Anna. Let me know. Hmm. Dramas. Nah, she's making no noises, guys. She's not letting me know. I quite like that one. <gasps> so she likes that one. Anna. You know, it's a little bit raunchy, girl. It's a little bit raunchy, but that's what she chose, guys. We've got to give her the raunch, but she can take those slippers off because they're not raunchy at all. What about them? Little jelly things. 
Right, that'll do. That's a bed work. I just hope she doesn't answer the door like that or go parading outside. That wouldn't be good. Right, party wear. She can dress as a gnome. <laughs> oh, I don't think the gnome's going to... Oh. Well, I'm sorry, Anna, if you don't like that. I quite do. And I'm going to keep like that for the beach. What about hot weather? Hot weather. Not that. Something a bit more Anna. What about that? No. I don't like that. What about that? What about the style? Let's have a look on the style looks. Definitely won't be that. What about this? <laughs> right, yeah. I think she's liking that. And then huh? we're going to go for... That one? No. Well, I don't like that pet. I'm sorry, I don't care if you do. Now, that's a nice outdoor one, but we do want to put some gloves on. So, let's have a look. Gloves. Accessories. And let's get some gloves on the girl. And I think that will do nicely. I think I want to change that hat, though. Or at least change the colour. To more that colour. And that is our Anna. Pretty good to go, guys and girls. Pretty good to go. Right, so Anna is actually ready to move out. So how do I move her out, guys? Let me just save it first before I start doing anything. Because it is The Sims 4. And it does have its issues. I, I didn't want to go there. I wanted to go. No. Just manage worlds. Right, so you can split her from a household and move her out. But don't you have to move her somewhere? See, this is where we're living now. And let me see. What options do I have? More. Right, so manage household and transfer sims between household. So I want mine, which is here. So if I click on her and move her out. So she's Anna's moved out now. She's moved in with uh, Danica. Don't know if anything's going to happen, guys, but, you know, she's out. Out into the world. And we are left with an extra slot in our home. Which means Mandy can now go out on the pull once again. Right, so next on the agenda. We're going to add birthday candles to this cake. There's my 1500 for my royalties. And then we've got Lizette and Luna. So I'm going to do Luna first. So I'll blow out candles. And then she can add candles. So she's already mean. Oh gosh. Oh, she's mean and clumsy, guys. It gets better and bleeding better, doesn't it? Right. Oh, creative. Right, so. We are a painter extraordinaire who's mean and clumsy. Beautiful. She's got a bonus trait as well, which is high self-esteem. Wow. That's quite a good one, that one. So, there is Lisette. Oh, Lisette is quite pretty, isn't she? What a beautiful girl. And Luna... It is your turn, my dear. Blow out candles for Luna. And let's get ready, guys. Ready, ready, ready to rumble. She's got a bonus trait as well. She's got self high self-esteem. The random trait. Oh, green fiend. So she's a geek and a green fiend. And...
and a market magnate. She wants to op uh, she wants to operate the most profitable food stand. Oh, well, that's interesting. <laughs> that is Luna. So there you go, guys. All right, I'm going to put that cake in here. Everyone is able to grab their own food. So, that is pretty good to go, isn't it? Oh, my gosh. She looks happy. Now I've got to figure out who's who again. Right, so that's Luna. Now Mama can actually go out. We're going to be leaving the home, but let me get skills. Uh, uh, levels up first, guys, and then I'll bring you back in. So, Mandy's up. I'm plodding about. I'm going to get her to eat that soup. I did buy that bin, guys. I'm sorry, I just needed to. I had the money, but I think it's a little bit OP. I've also had to get two extra toddler beds. Uh, so, Mandy, why did you wash that? Right, so we're going to set Mandy out. We don't need any care people or nannies because we've got the two teens there. It's time for the prom. No, we can do that in the uh, other series because I am doing Rags to Riches series with these Sims afterwards. Uh, so, Mandy, right. Get yourself out, Petal. Now, I am going to go to the bar in Henford. Because they do have nights in there. Where they do like different different things like bear nights and wolf nights and alien nights, which is who, who I want to meet up with. But it just depends. So we are going to go to the bar in Henford. That took a while to load. The Gnome's Arms, it is. So. Let's just ahoy me mate. I'm not interested in the woman. I'm sorry, mate. So it doesn't look like there's any special events on at the bar today. Is there anyone upstairs? Yes, there is. So ahoy me mate. Who are you? See, the other dude's there with his what looks like his wife. So I'm not. This wool is not woolly enough for the wool club. All right, there isn't a wool club, but this is a competition and I don't think it, it'll win. Right, so, stop talking. Go over to the bar. Oh. Right, so, what? Oh, he's just disappeared. Right, so it's singles night. Right, well, if it's singles night, everyone's up. Discuss phase. Where are you? Knock, knock, joke. Trick with hand buzzer. Bright and day. Joke about politicians. That, eh. Uh, Friendship is actually coming up a little bit, isn't it? And then we're going to meet this guy. Ahoy, me mate. So, we, we kiss hands. Oh, it's singles night, isn't it? Yeah. Brighton Day. Proposed crazy scheme. Gossip about booty. Kiss hands. Come on, it's a singles night. Let's see if it'll work. Probably not. Oh, my word, guys. Run a rig. I don't even know what that is. I'm probably insulting him. Let's flatter. Fitness techniques. Right and day. Looks like we've got our next baby daddy. Oh. 
Let's offer him a rose. Do I get one back? No, I don't. Compliment mighty fine garb. Show off muscles. No, don't stop. A supportive facial hair. Bright and day. Let's go on the romance bit. Flirtation. Ask to rock boat. Don't know, guys, but it sounds good to me. Pick up line. Declare love publicly. I love you, we've just met. Ask about career. Please don't go. Right, Mandy's going back home. I think it's time, guys. I think it's time. Let's get her back home. And we can actually invite him round. We do have the uh, age ups as well. There it is. I was going to say, where's me? Home. Right, so. Mandy's back home. She does need sleep. So, we're just going to put her to sleep. Right. How is everyone doing? You're fine. Why is Babby crying? You need food. Girl, there's food there. Harley could do with a bath. No. Has he got anyone to give him a bath? Get a bath from Luna. Where is Luna? That's Lizette. There's Luna. Oh, she's on the settee. Right, watch this, guys. This is why I said it's OP. Look at me money. 70 for that. Throw that food, babies. Throw that food. We'll be rich in no time. Right, so... I'll take advantage, because why not? I'm not breaking no rules. It's a recycle bin. Oh, there she goes. There's Elisha, the little streaker. Are you actually going to get in my bath? Get a bath from Luna, please and thank you. Come on. Mm. Get a bath from Lizette. Are you going to give a bath, Lizette? What? Why won't they bathe the kids? Right, go and get some food. There's some there. You can have that. Right, how's Mandy doing? She could do with the hygiene coming up a little bit. It's 7 o'clock in the morning. Uh, can you get a quick shower, Mandy, please? Because it's time to get pregnant again, my lovely. Let's get a shower and then we're going to phone up Kenny. Take a shower! Guys, don't do what I ask. Thank you. And then you can invite him to hang out. Anytime you like, Manda. Anytime you like, sweetheart. We'll be good. Can you do what I've asked, please? Thank you. Right, so, he'll be right over. And I do believe he will. Oh my gosh, what are you wearing? 
<laughs> Do you know what? I'm not sure. I want him to be a baby daddy, guys. What on earth? Discuss face. Let's see if we can do a bit of flirting. Ask if single. It was at the singles night, so I'm assuming so. I wonder why you're single, my friend. Now he's trying to chat my daughter up. Mandy? Guys, you know what? I seriously give up with this family. Right. Bright and day. I'd have to be woohoo partners, but we'd probably get offended. And obviously, Mandy's got to go off to go and look after one of her children again. Give him some parenting tips, because you're going to be a daddy. More choices. Flirtation. Flirt. Support his hair. Right, he's doing the flirty stuff. Ask about romantic interests. Kiss hands. Flirt. Ask about favourite author. It better be me. Recite love poetry. Confess attraction. Mandy! Pick up line. She likes fitness. Uh, do you know what? It... Whoa! Right, now it's time to go, Kenneth. It's time to go. Right, Mandy needs to get some food so she can just take a piece of cake. Difficult between Kurt and Lizette. Gets better and better. Just go to sleep, Manda. You're no use to anyone. Right, let's see if Lizette can serve some lunch. Let's just do some normal lunch, guys. That might be why the recycle bin is uh, taking of giving us a lot of money back. So she's going to do that, and then we're just going to place it in here. Right, so it's got nine hours left, and if I put it in here, it's going to have three days left. So that's good. So I can make food if and when we need to, and just put it in there. Uh, we do have a hungry child. That is Harley. I think she's going to be the tomboy of the family. And Wesley is also hungry. He also needs the toilet. So I'm going to posse him first. Ask for potty help off Lizette because Luna just doesn't do a thing I ask her to. It's also uh, time to age. Is it these? Yeah, I'm going to wait till tomorrow though because it still does have a little bit of an age up bar there. And it'll give me a little bit of grace also from buying beds. Right, so, Lizette is good. Can she actually get a, a job? It would help if it was or not. Right, Luna. Anna's calling to chat. Hello. So she's going to talk to her sister on the phone. That's nice. I should have gave Anna a key, shouldn't I? And then she could come in. Do you know what? She is constantly angry, man. Luna, what is up with your petal? Let's see what's the matter with her. Absolutely nothing. Trash. Simmering rage. Because she feels bitter about someone nearby. Right, let's just pause it and have a look at these. Crying toddler. So she doesn't like crying toddlers. From hearing family gossip, oh that's nice, she's playful. 
I've got this with confidence and obviously the simmering rage bit. Anna has spread some juicy gossip about Elisha. Elisha's a baby. <laughs> wow. Do, do you know what? This game gets better and better. Better and better. Right, so what time are we on? Seven o'clock. Right, so can you invite him to come and look? Where is he? Oh, right. Go for it, Mandy. Go for it, girl. Off she goes. Let's get the next baby daddy. Come here, dude. Dude, I like your top. I think it's absolutely beautiful. Hey! You can't go. Ask to hang out. Sexy pose. Off a rose. Kiss hands. <laughs> knock knock joke. <laughs> Discuss fears. First kiss, guys, we've got it. First kiss. There we go. Right, right, pause. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. Try for baby with Kenny. Kenny? You fancy a woohoo? Wo hey! No, no. Wait. You're not going to barbecue. Right, more choices. Action. Form group. You and Kenny. Right. And then I'm going to put go here together. So we'll get them both to come over here. And I was going to do it in the shower. Oh, shoot. I've got a child in my bed. Where? Where's Kenny? Dude, Kenny's gone. Try for baby with Kenny. Oh, he's there. Jeez Louise. Come on, Mandy. Oh, I might have to kick a kid out of my bed. Right, that's because the baby's in the bathroom. Who's in my bed? Sorry, pet. Needs to be done. I don't want to sleep. No. I'm going to miss out. Guys, we can't miss out. We need this baby. Right, come on. Mandate, do your thing, girl. Do your thing. Oh, do you want to make more babies? Yeah, I need to get a hundred. So if you could just give me one, that'll do. I don't care if you need the toilet. Just for babies. <laughs> Cowabunga, did you hear that? Cowabunga. So the romance is right up there, isn't it? Right, so, excuse me, pregnancy test. Call it done, girl. Let's call it done. Oh, gosh. She's got some better clothes on. Hey! And she's eating for two. Beautiful. Right, we've just had the notification, and I think that isn't for the babies. That is for Kurt and Elisha. So, it's time to age these little beauties up. So, let me... S I'm not sure what I want to be when I grow up. And all my friends seem to have it figured out. How do I figure it out myself? Pick something you like. No worries, you've got time. Study for a high-paying job. Yeah, get a high-paying job. That'll do you, pet. That'll do you. Right, so what are your needs looking like, Mandy? Absolute garbage. What about yours? Right, she can make a cake. Because we can do that. 
So let's go on. Let's go cook. Let's make a chocolate cake. Come on, girl, you can do this. Please don't burn my house down. I don't have a lot of money. Yet. Yeah. We're going to be rich and loaded, guys. Rich and loaded. I think she's like level zero, isn't she, on cooking? Yeah, they're taking food from there. That's good. So if they do starve, guys, it's not my fault. There's food. Do not anybody touch this cake. All right, add candles, please. And then we want Kurt and Elisha. Help blow out candles will be Kurt first. Let's have a look. Here comes Kurt, guys. Here comes Kurt. Child time. So we've got Cheerful. And then we've got... Oh. A Chore Master. <laughs> I'm all about the Chore Master, guys. There is little Kurt. And then if you can add candles again... And help Elisha blow them out this time. Elisha, the naughty, naughty streaker. Who's done all that mess? Right, Elisha, I'm actually intrigued to see what she's going to look like. Now, she is erratic. Oh, my days. And she is going to be... Nothing. Let's try again, guys. Let's try again. Guys, I can't hit it. Oh, right. We've got Grow Up Well. Do you want to have a happy and successful childhood? Nice. And that is our Elisha, the naughty little streaker. Oh. Well, she's not so naughty now, is she? I think she's doing a fine job. So I'm going to put the cake on there. I think I've bored you long enough with my vocals. Uh, I do have names for my next ch child or children. And I do hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, hit like button, guys. And if you haven't done already, please hit subscribe. Take care, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye!